Hi everyone, this is Eileen here from SingaporeOLevelMax.com. In this video, I'm going to share with you how we solve a cubic equation by synthetic division. This section is covered in GC O Level Additional Mathematics. Let us take a look at the equation that we have. First of all, you've got to recognize that this is a cubic equation because the highest power in this equation is 3. Therefore, we call this a cubic equation. Now, the first step in solving a cubic equation is to guess and check your first factor. So, what I did was, I actually went to use my calculator to solve this equation and I found out there are three answers to this. Let me just write it at the side. x equals to minus 1, negative 3 over 2, or half. So what I'm going to be doing is, I'm going to first let fx, which is function, to be 4x cubed plus 8x squared plus x minus 3. Now I'm going to pick out of these three answers here, one answer. So I'm definitely going to pick the whole number, negative 1, do a substitution. press my calculator, I end up with a 0. So therefore, I conclude x plus 1 is a factor of fx. We completed our step 1. Step 2 is where we're going to find our quadratic factor. And this is what I do. So I'm going to list down the coefficient of each term. which is 4, 8, 1, minus 3. So this is what we're going to do. Bring this 4 down, multiply by minus 1. How do I know it's minus 1? Because we've gotten the value of x to be minus 1 in step 1. So this is negative 4. Add up these two numbers to give us 4. Carry on, multiply by minus 1 again. You get minus 4. Add up these two numbers, you get minus 3. Multiply by minus 1, again, you get 3. Add up these two numbers, you get 0. So at this point, we need to understand what does these three numbers represent. They represent the coefficient of x squared, coefficient of x, and coefficient of the constant. One thing for you to take note is, whenever you are doing synthetic division, you got to ensure that your final value is 0. With that, we can continue. Since we have the first factor, which is x plus 1, the quadratic factor is found out to be 4x squared plus 4x minus 3 equals to 0. So to carry on solving this equation, I will be finding my... I will be factorizing my quadratic factor here using the simple cross method. So this will be 2x here, 2x, a 3, a 1, a minus sign here. So this will give me 4x squared minus 3, 6x minus 2x, 4x. So after I fully factorized, this is what I have. then we can solve it. x plus 1 equals to 0 or 2x plus 3 equals to 0 or 2x minus 1 equals to 0. Therefore, x equals to minus 1 or x equals to negative 3 over 2 or x is equals to half. So this is how we solve this cubic equation using synthetic division. And you can see that the answers that I have here tally with what we have found out by calculator earlier on. If you have enjoyed this video, do subscribe to my channel or visit my blog, singaporeolevelmax.com. I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.